When you carry a gun on a belt, it's a system. It's a holster and a belt. This is a regular dress belt. This is a lousy gun belt, isn't it, Matt? It is. It will not support the weight correctly. It just won't. Okay, we got a 1911 here. Let me just shove this thing on here. You put this on a regular dress belt, oh, it flops both ways. Well, not only is it not secure, it's just uncomfortable. It, well, not only that, you run into a safety issue as well. Well, exactly right. So you guys are now making belts. Yes, we make a very top quality premium cowhide belt. Okay, this is one of your belts. Look at this. Stays stiff. It keeps the gun where it's supposed to be. I mean, this is a heavy 1911. Yes, it right? is. Yeah, that is correct. And frankly, this is kind of a, a tough test because this holster is a little bit skinny. When you take one of your belt or your holsters, look at this, it's the crossbeat holster, because it's wider, slip it in there. Now it really holds it up. You got two things going for you. The holster design will help disperse the weight. Okay. And then the double two-layered belt, leather, bonded and sewn, will help distribute the weight evenly around your body. Okay, so you've got a th thick belt. That's one of the problems is your regular dress belts are just thin. That is correct. Th these, these are thick. They're actually two pieces of seven weight leather. Okay foregrain and cross grain and then we industrial bond them and then stitch them and what that does is that makes it the rigidity so you don't need an inner liner or anything else okay. this belt works just fine yeah, it's pretty with stiff. the two pieces of leather but I also like the fact that you're offering these different buckles I'm looking at you know kind of a regular buckle but this is very cool in fact that's the one I'm wearing right here this is our new buckle it's made by Aries and uh -huh. it's a very slipstream buckle you just slide your belt in Kind of like the early military style yep. belt that you've seen on the web. Just belts. locks up. Just locks up. And it is a very sturdy. They're made out of stainless steel. And if you have a little bit extra for your Thanksgiving dinner, you can let it out <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> it <laughs> is by far the most adjustable belt that we have ever produced. I mean, with, with a gun, go dress without a gun. Yep. It's just a universal belt. The, the simple fact is, if you're carrying a gun on a belt, the belt is an important part of the system. You need a good gun, you need a good holster, but you absolutely have to have a good belt. Crossbreed holsters, now making great gun belts. Whenever I run a training class, I always send out a list of preferred equipment or necessary equipment. And one of those things is a sturdy belt. A sturdy belt is absolutely necessary to your success in class. A belt like this one. That's thick and has an easy adjustable slider on it so that as the day goes on, if your belt starts to loosen up, you can snug it up. If you have holes in there, particular holes, it won't be as adjustable for you. So having a nice easy slider like this, sturdy leather construction, You'll thank yourself for it later. So next time you go to training, make sure you have a sturdy belt.